Hello and welcome to Big Black Gaming. Today we're going to try some Dark Souls 2. So I recently finished Dark Souls on the channel. Uh, rekindled the first flame. Uh, that was my first playthrough. Very much enjoyed it. It was a bit rough uh, with some of the mechanics. Some of the dodging and lock-on stuff was a little rough and hard to get used to. Because um, I came to Dark Souls after playing uh, Elden Ring, which was my first um, Souls-like, I guess. So we'll see if they improved things a little bit with Dark Souls 2. Uh, Mechanics-wise, everything else in Dark Souls was great. Um, I am a little disturbed by the lack of settings. There are literally no settings, no sound settings, nothing. There's video and that's it. So that's a little disturbing, um, but we'll, we'll see how it goes. New game. Brightness, I'm gonna make it a little brighter than I normally would. for YouTube and also because I want to see. Okay, we have more settings here. That's strange. Whoops. Okay. Can't wait for the cutscene. Seen it. Maybe in a the intro cutscenes are always good. Murky, forgotten land. It's like the Darkwood Basin. That hellhole. You will lose everything once branded. The symbol of the curse. An augur of darkness. Your past, your future, your very light. Melting. Oh, she's made of candle wax. None will have meaning, and you won't even care. By then, you'll be something other than human. A thing that feeds on souls. A hollow. Long ago, in a walled-off land far to the north, a great king built a great kingdom. I believe they called it Drang Lake. Perhaps you're familiar. No, how could you be? Um, that doesn't look but like one day you will stand before its decrepit gate. Anything I saw in Dark Souls. Uh, nice smile, lady. I mean, it did look like the City of Gods, kind of. But that was uh, an Orlando? Yeah. It's a blood boom.
What did I do? Like a moth uh -oh. to a flame. Sure, just leap into the pit. To the abyss we go. Well, that was perfectly clear. I know exactly what's going on. I have no questions. Now, I heard this game is... Um, kind of the... I guess people's least favorite in this series. It kind of gets a, a bad reputation. Kind of has a bad reputation. Um, I've seen most people when asked things betwixt, when asked what their favorite game in the series is, they usually say one or three. So, um, no character creation yet. We don't I don't know what we look like. I assume that's coming soon. We can punch. We can left punch. Okay. Can I kick? Oh. Chump attack? Okay. There's no jumping. That's uh, interesting. So, people's least favorite Dark Souls generally, but I've heard other people say it's not really that bad. So, we'll give it a try. Try to keep an open mind here. Ah. Rats? Oh, you're not rats, you're like... Mm, I don't know what you are, but... Die. Okay, already I'm liking the, uh... Increased lock on distance, it feels. Um, feels like maybe you can lock on enemies from further away. Let's try the rolling. Oh, it can roll diagonal. Okay, so instead of being able to roll in the four cardinal directions, I can roll in eight directions. That's good. That's an improvement. Those are some big footprints. Let's not go here.
Hello? <laughs> what seems to be the ruckus? Oh my, your face. The face of the curse. Can you remake my face for me? It's an undead. An undead has come to play. <laughs> they all end up here. All the ones like you. You spoke to that kind old dear, didn't you? <laughs> You're finished. You'll go hollow. Yes, you'll become one of them. Hollows prey upon men. Feast upon their souls. Never. I'll never go hollow. This is the fate of the cursed. <laughs> what is your name? Good question. Let's, uh... Try to remember it. I think that was it. Done. Okay. Yes. <laughs> At least you know your own name. See, I'm not fully hollow it's yet. Is it a sword? It's a human effigy. Oh. Take a closer look. Thanks. Who do you think it's supposed to be? It has no think shape. Deep into your past. It's just a couple of spheres. Yes. It's an effigy of it's me. An effigy of you. Can I shape it? There we go. Class and gift. There are classes? Oh, right. There are classes. Um, I liked warrior in the last one. Pretty simple, but... Tough, uh, high HP and adaptability, tough to take down. Ah, here we go. This is what I wanted. Uh, level, vigor, endurance, vitality, attunement. Strength, dex, adaptability. Boost agility and various resistances. Intelligence. Okay, so we don't need intelligence or faith. Or attunement. Uh, pretty much the same as last time, I think. We want vigor, endurance, and strength. Yeah, we're just going warrior, I think. Uh, what gift can we take? Oh, we can hold four rings now. That is... Perfect. Returns the hollowed to life. Okay, so we'll be using this. I can take that with me, but she already gave me one. Healing wares. Don't care. Homeward bone. Nah. Seed of a tree of giants. A seed grown from a tree of giants. Inedible. That's one possibility. Bonfire ascetic. Toss into a bonfire to raise the strength of nearby foes. Only for those seeking a greater challenge. But do they drop better stuff? Hmm. 
petrified something. A simple petrified lump and maybe of some use someday. Well, I tend to like to go for something mysterious like a petrified lump. Which may or may not be useless. Um, or the sea seed from a tree of giants. Don't know what it does. But maybe useful someday. The rest of this stuff seems... Uh, these are consumables. I don't really need those. Slightly increases HP. Nah, I can find some good rings. Seed of a tree of giants. I think I'll take that. Okay, how do I go? Yeah, here we go. Okay. Build. I'm not going to spend a lot of time on this because I don't really care that much. I want a tiny head. Hmm. Nah. We'll go with kind of a slim... Athletic build. Oh, we're not going to see our skin. This doesn't matter. Well, that's what I look like. I didn't spend a lot of time on it. I'm not going to be spending a lot of time looking at myself, so... for the same reason. To break the curse. You're no different, I should think. Hmm. Doesn't stand a chance. Says you. Well, you never know. <laughs> I get it. Through the door and trot along to the kingdom. But remember, hold on to your souls. They're all that keep you from going hollow. Will do. Oh, I'll fool you no longer. You lose your souls. All of them. Over and over again. Nope. <laughs> I beat the first game. Never died. All in one run. And I'll do it again. Reclaim flesh and set out as an undead. Okay, that was a steam achievement. I don't think it... It's going to show up in the recording. Okay, I'm not going to attack them. As tempting as it is. Which way did I come in? I come... I came in here, right? No. Wait a minute. Soul of Lost Undead, Torch. Wait a minute, what is this? Bonfires are places of respite. It may also light torches on them. Oh, okay. Well, we'll go out there in a moment. First... There's something out here I need to fight. I saw some footprints. Here. Okay. 
Okay. Do I have an Estus flask? Player status. react to invaders from other worlds. That's what the seed does. Ah, uh, well, I don't need that. Should have taken the other thing then. Oh, wait a minute. Torch. Five minutes. Oh, there's a... Okay. There's a timer on the torch after I light it. Interesting. Hi there. You mind if I just Oh, that looks ridiculous. Trying to two hand a it's a broken sword, it's not gonna do anything. Uh, oh god. It's a Cyclops hippo. Alright, well that death doesn't count. I'll come back for him. See Daisy. Oh, look at me, I'm beautiful now. Do I how do I use the torch? Can't equip it. It's not like a real item. Burn. You have no items to burn. Item box. Travel. Oh my god, fast travel from the start. Thank you. Attack our weapon. Lock on. This looks, uh, this looks ridiculous. Two handing a broken sword. Uh, dash. Okay. Yep. Same as before. What happened there? Light these though. Let's go to key bindings. Or a key binding for Using the torch. Well, I guess we'll get, we'll probably get a tutorial on it at some point. Oh, it's another Cyclops Rhino. Hippo. Wow, 
Wow, that was a backstab. Behind enemies back. Critical hit. Well, this doesn't look like a very friendly place, I gotta say. I feel like I should be able to light these with a torch. A dagger. Now, is that actually going to be better than her garbage sword? No. Let's have a look here. Counter strength. Poise. Strength of impact disrupting opponents. Poise. I don't think it showed you that in the first game. Physical attack. Alright, yeah, the dagger is not better than our broken sword. Uh, roll. Switch equip weapon, got it. Going through the tutorial. Back step. Yeah, I found that to be useful. Uh, the archers have a very short wind up. compared to the previous game. Come on. Life gem. Oh, do I not have an Estus flask in this game? Do I have to use consumables? I don't know if I like that. Use item. You mean interact with item? Like pick it up? I did that. I don't know what X is. Um, move camera. Because these are Xbox uh, controller prompts. At least I think they are. Yeah, these are Xbox, so I'm not using an Xbox controller. Uh, what does this say? Move camera, right. Okay. Hey. You were in the first game. I know you were. Um, smooth, silky life gem? Leave or discard? I guess leave? Wait. How do I... I'm trying.
this card. Why proceed? What is Y button? Um. I want to drop it. I want to give you a, um, a silky. You, you, give us smooth. Yes, you, give us silky. Okay, sort. So Y is triangle. So if I click leave, and then Y, nothing happens. Discard. Why? Nothing happens. You want a soul? Here, you can have that. Nothing happens. Oh, is it because I have it equipped? Okay, well, I already... left that. Okay, let's pick it back up. Alright, sorry about this. It's, uh... Okay, stop equipping that, and then let's go to uh, inventory. Leave. One. All right, have fun. All right, I'll come back there after I rest. Maybe they'll give me an item in exchange. I think that's what they were asking for. All right, let's... um. Re-equip that. Ah, light torch. go. I wonder if this persists if I die. Wield right weapon two-handed. Oh, okay. My torch is out. Okay, I'm gonna reduce the volume slightly. Game options. Okay, we'll try that. I don't want to reduce it too much. Let me know how the volume is, because I, I have a lot of trouble getting audio uh, volume right on the games. Uh, in comparison with my voice. What? Jumping? Left. Okay. They do have jumping. Okay, that's a little better than it was in the first game. Yeah, before it was weird. You hold down the... Run key, and then you let go of it, and you press it again. And that's how you jump. Slightly restore spell use, okay. And it was really awkward. So this is an improvement.
Ah, almost ran off. Okay, we can relight our torch. Actually, let's go back to the bonfire here. And see if we get an item. From the... Birds. Oh, there's an item there too. Smooth. I didn't accept my life gem. Smooth silky. Okay. I'll keep an eye out for something smooth and silky. Something down here. Soul of a nameless soldier. Well, they do stay lit. Wonder if there's any kind of benefit to um, lighting all of them. Hi there, how you doing? Can I attack? I can attack with the torch, cool. Statue blocks your way. Are you sure you're a statue? Okay. This looks like uh, Ash Lake. Is that where I am? The underground forest? Might be messages. Right leg. I can't take this, help me. Now the real fight begins, by the way, are you ready? Absolutely. Oh my god, look at all the bloodstains. Alright, I haven't died yet. So we can't die now. Horse? Yeah, no horse. Not in this game. Not that I... Not that I know of. Not until Elden Ring, buddy. Majula. How did you die? I see. How about you? Okay, people seem to be jumping off. I guess they're looking for secrets. I don't see anything down there. Yeah, I don't see a ledge or anything. I see something over there. Cave. Hole ahead. Indeed. Okay. Try right down, yeah. Right. Here should be safe.
Morning Star, Cleric Sacred Chime. I think we got a new weapon. Yep. Scales with strength. Okay, that's going to put me into heavy load territory. I think. But, uh, maybe not. We're over 50% load, though. Can I check my load? Soul memory. Souls that once dwelled within the flesh will always remain in memory. Okay, that's a new thing. Movement slows as your equipped load approaches maximum. Yeah, so I don't know what the thresholds are for medium and light load and heavy load. Um, if it's the same... ...as the first game, then... ...if I'm over 50%, then I should be at heavy load, but... ...I am moving pretty quickly, so... ...I don't know for sure. Oops. My inoculars... Look carefully. Can we put binoculars on our items? No. Oh, it's a... Uh... Okay. Let's uh, take off the shield for now. I think I'm gonna... Go uh, two handed. All right, from here, I'm not. Seeing anything. How do we get, get back up? Oh, here we go. I can't take this. Alright, we got a castle. Oh! Use the... Yeah, there we go. Use the binoculars. There we go. Castle in that direction. Okay. Fire. All right, it's a little abandoned town. That's kind of interesting. Maybe this is the uh, the hub, like the Firelink Shrine of the first game. All right, so a couple ways we could go. Up there, that's where we came from. There's a cave up there too. Down there, um, explore the town. Up there many different things we can do. Oh, it's an interesting start. 
So far, so good. No deaths. Proud of that. Oh, we got a visitor. Okay. We'll talk to her next time. Alright. Uh, yeah, let me know if the sound is okay or if I need to adjust it more up or down or, or whatever. But uh, I'll see you next time. Thank you for watching.